consider a, uh, a bittersweet project, the Croc Center. And I say it's a bittersweet project because, one, the sweetness of it is it's the largest community center in New England is located in our community. 90,000 square feet of a building, all the services and dreams and hopes that this community has ever wanted is in this building. Now, the bitter part is that 70% of our community can't afford to go here because the fees are way too high. So we consider it bittersweet. We do acknowledge that we were the community partner on this project. We continue to have dialogues with the Army to try to figure out what are ways to open up their minds around how they can actually service the community better. Um, unfortunately, those talks have not really gotten us anywhere. So, yes. Can you ask um, how much the fees are? So for a family of four, it's $80 a month. Whoa. So. You also go to school with somebody who's Who's in the Salvation Army? Yeah, no, I mean, I. Never know. They're, they're, <laughs> never know what. Friends that make you react, yeah. Oh, to I mean, influence like, the person. He just has to use So, influence. yeah, I would, I, I would love any type of influence. I mean, they do say that they have financial aid, but financial aid is 14 documents that you have to bring to them, and that there's a waiting list for their financial aid, which is, you know, for us as a community, residents took time out of their days, 120 meetings it took to get this building where it is community meetings, 120 different conversations that residents had about design, what you go in the building, programming. Um, and as what we'll do is we're actually going to walk around the building that there's some really cool things in here that we would love uh, to have more access to. Uh, but unfortunately, and this is where I think um, the, the H-bomb does not work here in this community because they actually relied on a Harvard Business School study in terms of how they actually developed their business plan is based on interns that came from that school. And every time that we talk about it, they say, but, but, but these Harvard students, you know, gave us this and this is what we're doing because, you know, because they're great. And unfortunately, that really rubs us the wrong way because those students didn't have any knowledge as to what's happening in our community. So, so we're going to take a walk around the building, uh, do some quick, you know, highlights of some really cool features, and then we're going to keep going along our way. Okay? Great.